Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve the second part of question number third. Okay, now in this case, again there is an AP whose first term is seven, and A thirteen is thirty five. Means the thirteenth term of that AP is thirty five. You have to find the common difference and the sum of those thirteen terms. S thirteen means you have to find the sum of those thirteen terms. So here. There must be seven as a first term, and we have to add a constant to this to make the second term, and so on. This AP will be till thirty-five. Now, first of all, you have to find the value of common difference where the last term of this AP is given to you, and the AN to find out the last term, we have a formula. This one. And the last term is given to you as thirty-five, which is a thirteen, and the first term is seven, and there are thirteen terms in this AP, and the common difference you have to find out. Now this is thirty-five is equal to seven. This is twelve, and this will be twelve d. Now, if I shift this constant to this side, this will be thirty-five minus seven. And this will be twelve d. Now thirty five minus seven will be twenty eight, and this will be equals to twelve d. And the common difference will be equals twenty eight upon twelve, and this will be equals to four three times and four seven times. So the common difference here must be equals to seven by three. So the common difference is seven by three. Or you can further solve this, and you can calculate this in points, or you can say in decimals. Now, after that, you have to find the sum of these thirteen terms. Now, for that, what we have to do is we have a formula that the sum is equal to n by two, two a plus n minus one into d, and there is another formula which says the sum is equal to n by two. A plus L, where the first and the last term is given to you. You can use this formula also, where A is the first term and L is the last term. So here the number of terms are thirteen by two. The first term is seven, and the last term here is thirty-five. Now this is thirteen by two, and thirty-five plus seven will be equal to forty-two. Now this can be cancelled twenty one times, and the sum will be equal to thirteen by multiplied by twelve. And sorry, this is twenty one. So thirteen into twenty one will be thirteen into one is thirteen. So we can write three carry one, and thirteen into two is twenty six, and there was a carry one. So this will be twenty seven. So two seventy three will be the sum of this series. So this is how you can solve this question. If you like this video please subscribe to our channel and if you have any problem in maths you can contact to us the phone number and the email address is given below in the description thank you